there. All right, so we're talking about Sunday's tornadoes. Third most active day in state history for tornadoes with 23 tornadoes confirmed at this point. They'll head back out again today as we talked about, but very close to the second most active day in tornado hit to history for us. That will be May 30th and the first most active, most active day, June 2nd, 1990. So a very active day for us on Sunday. Yesterday, as the crews were out, they were dealing with a gusty wind as they were surveying that damage. Temperatures made it to about 50 degrees for us here in Indianapolis, about 53 for Bloomington. For 47 for Muncie today. The good news is that the winds are calming down. The bad news is that temperatures will cool off just a little bit. Sunshine will stick around. Hey, I love looking at this map because it allows you to actually see how it feels out there. We're comparing this morning to yesterday morning. This morning it is 12 degrees cooler than where we were yesterday morning at this point. If you remember yesterday morning, we we're about 15 to 20 degrees cooler than the morning before. So we continue to see these very cold mornings for us behind this cold front. How cold? Well, we're below freezing right now at 29 for Indianapolis. You're at 31 for Bloomington at 30 for Muncie. So we start off cold this morning. We do have a northwest wind, but this will change to an easterly wind throughout the day. Seven miles per hour winds will remain calm. Humidity at 78%. The air will remain dry today. You will see a few clouds here and there, but overall sunshine will win out for you. So we're talking a mostly sunny day. Quiet all around the region because of high pressure that's in control for us. This system moving over us, drying out the conditions, bringing the sunshine to your forecast. But by tomorrow afternoon, we get in on increased cloud cover for you. And then those showers begin to move to you on Thursday. Thursday. So Thursday and Friday, we are expecting some rain in the forecast for you. I'm not expecting, of course, those heavier downpours, torrential rain like we were seeing on Sunday, but definitely adding rain to the forecast. So enjoy the dry air, although we only make it to 46 for today. Sunny but cool tonight, dropping to 29 degrees. Speaking of 29 degrees, in this extended forecast, we actually have a high temperature of 29 degrees. You know, this week is winter preparedness week, and we're talking about winter weather now. Temperatures drop to the 20s with a chance of snow in the forecast by Saturday.